Well, you guys, it seems Microsoft is now making a new PC migration app for Windows 11. Microsoft seems to be working on this new migration app to better help users transfer files and apps and data from one PC to another. This was discovered by Phantom of Earth and also brought to you by uh, Dongle, as you can see here on his Twitter account. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. First, you can see here, what would you like to do? It says back up this PC or you have transfer files to a new PC. Once you click on the next screen, it says searching for network connection. Then you can move on to the next part of the app, which says easily transfer info from one PC to another. It will give you this type of OTE to type out. And then once you've done that, you can move on to the next phase of the transfer. Here it says, is this PC uh, you would like to transfer files from? You can say yes, start the transfer or no. Once you click yes, it's going to start the transfer. Then you'll get this next pop-up screen saying waiting for other PC to begin transfer to make sure the PC is connected to the power outlet throughout the transfer process. And you can see here transfer process initiated the new PC. And you can see on the screen is gone from uh, say one old PC to a new PC. And again, your transfer has now been completed and you've just transferred all of your data and programs and stuff over to that new PC. So the first option would be obviously to back up all your files to the selected Microsoft Cloud Storage service like OneDrive. And the second option, which is your transfer files from one PC to another, works basically like copying or transferring all the data from one PC to another. Now, if you cancel out or the internet loses connection, it will look something like this. And this is something that's been compiled by Dongle himself. But before we continue, let's have a quick word from today's video sponsor, CD Key Sales. If you're looking for a cheap Windows 11 Pro OEM key, then check out the links in the video description. Once you click on those links, you can create yourself an account and buy the actual key and use my promo code capital B capital R 09 and apply this to your order and get a 30% discount on all of your purchases on CD Key Sales. Once you've done that, you can submit your order, use your payment method. They will then send you your key and you can use that key to activate your version of Windows just like you see on the screen right here. Very simple and easy to do. Now, Dongle does mention that the images are not of the real app, but of a reconstruction of the UI of bits left in the build. So some of the styling and layout details might be incorrect due to the incompleteness of the decompilation. But Microsoft are working on a migration app and obviously this UI reconstruction is just something that they're trying to piece together to show you exactly what it will probably look like when it's been completed. So obviously things can change. Obviously full credit goes to Dongle and also Phantom of the Earth and Ahmed Walid for sharing this information. I do appreciate it because it allows us to give you more information and share it to a larger audience. But I do want to give them the credit for sharing the information and the images uh, for this so we can share it with you guys. Anyway, now Microsoft have created a migration tool in the past. You can see here the user state migration tool, which is USMT for short. This was a command line uh, based type of migration. And you can see here, which was quite a complex uh, way of migrating uh, the system. And uh, I will leave a link for this in the video description. But again, you can also use other things like PC Mover Express and other things like that as well. But these aren't free utilities. I'll quickly show you some of the other alternatives that you might want to look at, which is mentioned here, which is the Laplinks uh, PC Mover. This has been around for many years, since probably Windows XP, if I remember, for, to help you migrate from one operating system to another. And it copies all of your data and your applications and everything else and completely transfers it over to a new operating system. Again, this is not going to be a free application, but it is out there and it has been out there for a very long time. And these are not the only ones that are out there creating applications like this. So I suppose Microsoft want to bring their own alternative, which will be in-house on their own operating system, which obviously means people don't have to then go out and install third party software and pay for software. So they're trying to probably, uh, you know, help people by putting that onto the system for you. Again, it's just a lot of bloat for other people, but some people will find it useful. Uh, Z install is another transfer everything to a new computer type application that you can use which has been out there for a while, and Windows Easy Transfer for Windows 11 and Windows 10. 
It's a free download, but it is a paid app. They're not free applications that you can use. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below, whether you think this is going to be a useful application or whether it's just another piece of bloat that you're going to have to disable and uninstall from the system. I'll be happy to read your comments and also respond to them when I can. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. I just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members, whether you're tier one, tier two or tier three. I really do appreciate the support. And I just want to mention that if you haven't joined our new Discord server, the link is in the video description. If you want to chat, I'll see you over on the Discord server. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.